Back in September of 2010, there was a flood that swept through here at Twin Springs Preserve. So all along here, the Georgetown salamander lives under large rocks and the flood uh, moved those rocks to the side of the spring. Connor came to me and said he was interested in doing some kind of project helping to restore the habitat. The habitat of the Georgetown salamander is very specific. And without those large rocks, the salamander can't survive. A goal of my project was to bring the salamander population back up. The size and scope of this project required a lot of volunteer hours, a lot of resources. There was a lot of prerequisites before I even started it recording what I saw and what I needed to do, gathering all the materials and the volunteers. There was a lot of paperwork. Here's one right here. After the site was restored with Connor's work, the number of salamanders came back up and has remained pretty steady since that time. We installed signs that kind of educated the public about... And what really impressed me about Connor was that he went to great lengths to really learn about the salamander. People have only ever observed it at 16 different places, all within uh, Williamson County, Texas. So this is kind of a crown jewel property for the county as a part of our habitat conservation plan and our conservation foundation. I really feel like I made a big difference in just the environment around here and in the Georgetown salamanders species itself.